Hi guys, it's Carly and I'm on my way to school and it's very snowy out and every school technically got a two hour delay but us so that's <laughs> Here's us driving. normal to me I what I ate for breakfast was pumpkin cupcakes <laughs> and I straightened my hair so see you after school so here's dinner actually this is the first week in a long time that I actually made a whole meal plan for the week and uh, cooking different meals every day now that Ken and I aren't on Nutrisystem anymore and I feel like while we were on Christmas break all we did was eat out but um I just cut up some red skin potatoes because I don't know I just like they taste a little bit better than regular potatoes and ham and I actually threw in a can of um white corn I really like white corn and um I like it kind of I don't know not like real thick I like it kind of soupy it's not really soup, but sort of, I don't know. And just put in some onion powder and salt and pepper. That's it. So this has been cooking for about four hours. So it's about time to eat. Okay, so hi guys. Today I'm just going to show you what I drew for Dumb Ways to Die. And in one of my videos on our One Take Sunday, I showed you three that I made. But actually I've made more. I could just show you all of them, but I still have five more to make, so I'm just going to show you now. <sighs> Actually, I keep them inside of my iPad case. I don't know why, though. It just seems like a good place for them. So, here is the first one. Here's the second one. Sorry, it gets out of control. Here's the third one. Here's the fourth one. Here's the fifth one. Here's the sixth one. Here's the seventh one. Here's the eighth one. Here's the ninth one. Here's the tenth one. Here's the eleventh one. <laughs> Here's the twelfth one. Here's the thirteenth one. Fourteenth one. Fifteenth one. Sixteenth one. And seventeenth one. This is my official favorite. I think I'm going to remake this one though because of the button. I don't really like that because it's floating necessarily. So I'm going to redo him. Actually, you can watch me do that, but since I took the hard work to make it, I'm just going to trace it. And no, I do not trace any of these. If you want to think that, I mean, you can, but I do not trace them. So I was watching this one video, and I'll tell, I'm going to tell you how I came up with the idea to make them. So one day I was watching this girl. I looked up Dumb Ways to Die. Because I was bored and I just wanted to do something and I was playing the game. So then I looked up Dumb Ways to Die. And then this nail artist popped up. And then I watched the video. She was really good though. She made like Dumb Ways to Die. Like um, people on her fingers which was really cool. Then I thought I'm good at drawing. Why don't I draw some? So then I decided to draw them. And now I was only going to draw like four, but now I drew like eight. No, actually like 15, two, three, four, five, six. But sometimes I mess up. I'm not always perfect at this. Uh, he was hard to draw though. Cause, but the thing that is really hard is finding the color for them. Because sometimes you think this... It's like a perfect color, and then you realize, no, it's not the perfect color. It's not what you wanted, but I guess it can work. 
See, like, so, like, sometimes I make his one arm higher than the other, so then when I'm done, I erase one, and I pick which one looks better, then I make it at the right spot. I have to be nice and steady, though. Here, I'll show you what I'm doing. Wait, it's my people eating there, so if I want to give that away. Here, I'm going to draw like a pole to the ground and see if Chase wants it. And I would have to say maybe the hardest one to draw would actually be probably the worst one. This one. It was like so hard to draw because... Like, in the video, it only gave you, like, one little portion to copy down from. Not, like, copy, like, get your ideas because you don't know what he looks like. So, it was really hard to copy down because it only shows, like, that much of its body. So, it was really hard. So, and then you outline them like that. See how it goes all the way around. And then what I usually do... I outline around his eyes, and if you're going to draw him, for you, like, the best thing is not to get it into the black. That's why sometimes I choose to, like, color outline around his eyes first, because then you get black on the marker, then some of the point, some of it ends up on the marker, and then when next time you draw, it gets black on it, so you want to get as close as you can to it but you don't want to touch it so like that and then you just color them in but actually this is what happened when i first made the first one i made the marker go in all different decorations i made it go side up that way i made it go all kinds of different directions so but then in this one the old one i drew it up and down all through the whole thing so it didn't look bad because this one though I'm going to draw sideways going up so see I told you it takes a really long time so I'll show you that when I'm done so I just got back from dance because I had to leave and get dressed but then before I went I finished him luckily but I didn't have any time to show you guys so and I'm going to end the video right now so that's when it turned out like. The question of the day is, do you have snow where you live and do you have a snow day? Did you have a snow day? So, I want a snowball. Bye, that's it for today. Please subscribe to our channel and your thanks for watching. And make sure you love Tori. And if you could, please thumbs up this video because it helps us a lot.